All right, and we're continuing on here with a scholarship uh, case two data file. And this is part two, we're at number 10 on the actual question worksheet. In the scholarships worksheet, configure rows one through three so that they are present but not visible. All right, so in the scholarships worksheet, we're going to go ahead and click on row one and drag it down to number three. And then we're gonna go ahead and right click on them and we're gonna say hide. All right. And number 11 says delete column I, all right? And I is right here. And again, we're gonna click on the actual letter I, right click on it, and we're gonna say uh, delete. All right, very easy. In cell D5, use a function that will take a copy of cell B5 and capitalize the first letter, all right? And this is a function called proper. Whenever you're capitalizing the first letter, it's called proper, all right? So formulas in the text group, you're gonna see proper, and you're gonna click on cell B5, which is Goldstein, and just press enter, click okay. And all it does is it capitalizes the first letter as if you were making it proper, all right? It doesn't say to carry it down to the rest of the cells, so I'm not going to go ahead and pull it down. Configure the scholarships worksheet so that column A repeats on every page, all right? So under the page layout tab, you're gonna notice here that we have a page setup group, and I have a couple different things that I can do as far as um, printing options. And that's pretty much what I'm talking about when I'm talking about page setup. I'm talking about the way that the spreadsheet would look if I printed it. So I'm gonna go ahead and say print titles. And you're going to see here I have two options right here that say rows to repeat at the top and columns to repeat at the left. And I'm going to go ahead and click on columns to repeat at the left. And I'm going to go ahead and click on column A. And then I'm going to click OK. All right. On the scholarships worksheet, apply a title style to cell A4. All right. So cell A4 is right here. And under the home tab, we do have some cell styles. And one of them is called a title cell style. Okay, and I'm not going to go ahead and fix the cell or do any kind of text wrapping or anything like that. I'm just going to leave it the way it is. Um, on the scholarships worksheet, <clears throat> worksheet in cell E5, modify the formula to display the letters in uppercase for athlete's last name. All right, so I'm going to go to the formulas tab. I'm going to go to text and I'm going to go to upper and I'm going to go ahead and click on, what is it, the last name, the last name? which is Goldstein again, this time it's going to capitalize everything instead of just the first letter, all right? And it does say, no, it doesn't. Nope, just for the one athlete. It doesn't say to carry it down to everybody else, all right? And that's the end of part two, all right? There's a lot more we could do here, but believe me, we have a lot more to get through. Um, so look for the video for part three, uh, and that is called Student Scores um, Case 3 Data File.